All right, welcome to day three of Credit 4, your Excel credit here. Uh, we're on page 13. We're looking at the first practice there. It says, open your schedule and change the name of the tab to January. Okay, the tab is this thing down here at the bottom. So we're going to change the name of the workbook here to January. Just going to rename it. January. Add all borders to your schedule so each time and day has its own box. And what they mean, I mean by that is we're going to highlight this whole block of color right here. And then we're just simply going to go up here and go to where it says all borders. Now, cell always looks like it has borders because every single cell is outlined. But if you were to actually print this without actually physically putting the border around it, nothing would show up. So you need to actually tell Excel to draw lines around those borders. Uh, let's see what else we have to do. Add 12 new tabs by copying the existing worksheet. Rename them February through December. All right, and the simplest way to duplicate uh, a page of a workbook is to right-click, go here where it says Move or Copy, and then we're going to, it says Move to Book, so it's going to be within the same workbook, and we're going to put, uh, we're going to create a copy, we're going to move it to the end. We don't want to put it before January. We want to put it after January. Click OK. Now look, it's created an exact copy of January. I've missed, I've missed up January. First thing we need to do is correct that. There we go. Second of all, we need to double click on this and we need to change it now to February. And there you go. And then you're going to right click. We're going to move our copy. We're going to move it to the end. OK. Oh, I didn't click my button. Did I move our copy? I'm going to click Create Copy. Move to end. There we go. So this is, and then we're going to February, and we're going to type in Mark here. So this is a very easy way to make exact duplicates of the thing. Now we could hit this button, make a new sheet, uh, select this. Copy it, go over here, paste it. But you see, the formatting wouldn't be the same. You'd have to come in here and mess with the formatting. So it's actually easier to um, delete that. It's actually easier if we uh, copied the entire workbook here. So instead, we're going to right click, move or copy, move to end, create a copy, click OK. And then we'll double click on the name and change the name. As you can see here now, I've got uh, November, October, September, August, July, all the way across here. And you see these three dots. If I click right there, it takes me to January and February. So I've got the whole year across the bottom there. And now I just click Save and save it to my flash drive. And that's it for this screencast. So thanks for watching and good luck.